Hey Stampin' Friends, welcome to Movie Monday with Jody Breckbill, Stampin' Queen. I don't even have a card to share with you guys today because I am just going to create right here in front of you. So this is kind of an idea that was triggered from a card we made at a meeting over the weekend. And so I'm just going to work with it right here. And we're going to use the Timeless Tropical stamp set and the... the um, in the Tropics dies, so this is our die set that we have that coordinates with this stamp set. This one is the one that has that fabulous pineapple in it, which is so awesome. We're not going to use that on this card. We are actually going to focus on the um, designer series paper, pa the designer series paper, the designer series paper that coordinates with it. And so I have pulled in soft sea foam soft suede and this super cute piece of DSP. So it's got these cute little um, like surf wagons on it. And then on the other side, it's got the weave uh, in the soft suede that coordinates with the, um, um, oh my gosh, I'm losing my train of thought, embossing folder. So this is a whole suite of products that we got going on here. So I'm gonna take my soft, or my, yeah, my soft sea foam cardstock and fold that in half. I just like to use my bone folder here and make it nice and crisp. Then I've got my piece of soft suede and my designer series paper. So I'm going to pull this in and look at you guys. This is the little baby trimmer. Um, I call him Carl Jr. So he is the perfect addition that I didn't know that I needed. So as demonstrators, we were able to pre-order in December and I was able to get this little mini trimmer and <clears throat> he is just the perfect complement to my big Carl which I use it's a um, rotary trimmer that I use for all of my massive cutting when I'm prepping for classes and then I've got my stamp and trimmer which I use for trimming up some layers but he just sits right on my desk and I have found that I am using him way more than I even thought that I would trimming little layers, just lopping off a bit here and there. So I'm going to cut at three and one quarter. Oh, let me tell you how to get him, See, because you can't buy him. So he is available when you join my team during celebration. So this is one of the products that you will get is this little mini trimmer, perfect little tabletop trimmer, and he is strong. Like he might look little, but he is mighty. So he can cut really well about perfect for those six inch packs of paper that we have. Um, just like I said, doing little trimmers, uh, little trims here and there. If you are a scrapbooker, you would love that for um, scrapbooking, <clears throat> uh, for trimming your pictures. So available during celebration, which is now through the end of March, you will get this for absolutely free, as well as a sampler pack of designer series paper which this is one of them the tropical o oasis will come in that as well you will also get a stamp set of your choice for absolutely free and then you get 125 dollars of product of your choice for only 99 dollars. so hit me up and i will tell you how to go about signing up to be one of my movalist stampers so i did a little trim here now let me see if this will work i might have to trim it a little bit more. No, it's going to work just absolutely perfect. So what I did was just a little bit of dimension in this card and I just cut my DSP at three and a quarter and I'm going to attach that to my soft suede piece. And I'm just, now what I could do is I could flip that for a little bit of texture, but I'm going to leave it this leave it here and just have a little bit of a dividing line there. So it almost looks like I have a, another layer on my card, but I, but I really don't. It just kind of spread it out just a little bit. And then that's going to go onto our card base. All right, now I'm Oh, I might have lost oh, my piece that I need. All right, so I took some soft sea foam and I used the Stitched So Sweetly dies. If you don't have these or haven't seen these in the new mini catalog, check them out. There's a coordinating stamp set that goes with it. So you can bundle them together and save 10% or you can get this set of dies, which stands alone. So it will totally work 
by itself, but it's got great little labels. It's got the rectangles with the scallopy edge, and I used this one right here with the stitching to create this piece that we're going to stamp on. So I'm just gonna pull in my Memento Black, and I'm gonna stamp our sentiment on here. Always needing birthday cards, so we're gonna do a birthday. Then I've got, um, I was hoping I had dimensionals here, but I'm not, oh no, I do have them. So this is the braided, oh, I don't know the name of it, braided jute ribbon maybe that is part of the tropical suite. And I like this because I'm just going to fray the ends a little bit. So you can actually take this apart if you want and make it smaller, but I'm just gonna fray the ends so it kind of looks like it's a little bit worn. It is woven. And uh, so I'm gonna do a little bit of adhesive on here and just lay that on the front of my cardstock. I might have to trim it down a little. We'll, we'll see how long it goes. Oh, no, I think it's perfect. Pull in my dimensionals. And attach that to my card front. This is such a fast, very fast and easy card and kind of perfect if you're in need of maybe some masculine cards. So I like that, I thought it was cute, but it needed a little bit more. So in the die set for the Tropical Suite, I do have these little flowers. I went ahead and cut them out in real red, and I'm just going to attach them with a glue dot. glue dot stick yeah it's stuck on there and then I've got my wee little one here and then finally I'm gonna add some of our new rhinestones that are in our catalog or the new mini catalog as well and I love using my take your pick tool and the little poker end, so I'm just gonna put that right in here. Maybe, there we go. And I can just pop these off, super, super easy. Or maybe not as easy as I think it is. It's sliding. All right, so let's try this end then. If that one wants to slide on us, let's see if we can pick it up with the gummy end. And I'm just going to put them right there in the center. Going a big one though for this. And do we have medium? Yeah, perfect. All right, so if you guys do not have one of these tools, highly, highly recommend it. I'm using it all the time, absolutely love it. So <clears throat> you can use that little pick tool to get your rhinestones off, or this end has a little bit of that tacky um, clay of. I don't know, clay, I don't know what it is. Anyway, it's tacky, so it works great for sequins. We have a lot of sequins in our uh, mini catalog as well as our celebration catalog. And I also love this end, let me go back and share this with you, the spatula end. So if you're having trouble with your cling stamps, you can get that spatula under there and just lift them off so that you're not having to mess around with your fingernail. So anyway, kids, that is my quick and cute little card that I just created this morning. Hope you enjoy. Thanks so much for dropping by. Have a great week, and I'll see you next week for Movie Monday.